part of class. This is the concluding part and that year 98 students are finished. So as our custom is, I want to listen attentively, let your mind be engaged, let your do all these things in order to receive information, idea, and strategy for superior performance in your faculty examination and also in your, in your academic performance, in your academic pursuit in life. Therefore, we'll be asking questions from what, from different angles entirely from this kind of what, this segment, this session like that. So we'll be talking about what the opposite word, opposite word in meaning. So the instruction says, choose the word which is opposite in meaning to the underlying word in what in each sentence. So your ability to what to pay attention to the taste, to pay attention to what is social to help you best as what as a candidate in what in the examination or setting. But if you don't pay attention to what is social, you may be penalized by the word by the examiner. You won't be there when they are going well, the imagine your script. That's how it's good for you to what to pay attention, your ability to pay attention to the taste, to the social given to you. Make it easier for you to answer the question in, what, in each session what, correctly based on the word, based on the guideline you have, you have been given. Like this one, we'll be talking questions from this palace talking about what opposite word, what are what, 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 and Anthony's words. Right? So the first question in this segment says, why most of our recently elected legislators are living in are living in what a life of affluence and ostentation? The vast majority of all those elected those who elected them into what into office are what are unhappy. Why are they why are they not happy? They are unhappy because they are living in the world uh, a very world a life that is not what is not encouraging and their expectation from what from those who are the world that they voted to be in power, their expectation from them has been what has been cut short. They are like their standard of living is not what is not improved. Their cost of living is always on, is on the what on the high basis, on the what on a daily basis. So they see life as being life as being what turn against them in all what in all that magnification. That is why they are not what they are not happy. So the option A says influence. Option B is the player, option C is the poverty, option D the happiness, option D the consequence. Now you don't have to mind yourself about all this option. You don't mind the, the only word, the underlying word, based on the word, based on the social say your word can be fast and first limit to what to be rich. When you have issue, you will be live wealthy now. Right? You will be live wealthy. You will be happy. You will be always, always excited. Always enthusiastic. Always on the go. So the opposite of what of affluence can be traced to what? To lack. Not having anything. To poverty. The opposite of what of affluence. Affluence means having in what in abundance. Anything you want, you just order it and you get it. Affluence. Life of all, life of all, having it all, all in all, just name it, just name it, you get it. Question number next, I you understand that. And the next question is this It is generally believed that missus are what are not loved by what by many. I repeat the question again. It says, It is generally believed that missus are not loved by what by many. Option A, spendthrifts, option D, spenders, option D, orders, option D, savers, option D, tips. Others, tips. Now, when I talk about Mr. when you talk about Mr. Yeva, I mean what a stingy person. A what a niggard. A niggard, a person that I find it difficult to, that is not what, that is not generous. Too what, too mean. I get it. Stingy to the world, to the highest order. Like what, like national theater that never opened hands. So the opposite of Mr. can be said to what is going to spend with the person who wants to spend freely, who give others, who is generous. I got it. An open one, an open minded person, an open hand person who give freely with what with excitement. A liberal man. Question number next. Who you understand that? And the next question is this My brother primary school foundation was what was solid, and this affected is what is. Secondly, education. Option is sound, option is solid, option is shaking, option is weak, option is unventful. When you something solid, something strong. And the opposite of something means something what? Something vulnerable. Vulnerable. Something is vulnerable is known as something that is what? That is very what? Very weak. Which means option one, option this, what's the best answer? Question number next. Hope you understand that. Don't forget what I said as a question under what? Under Antonis. Talking about what? That what? Opposite in meaning. And the next question here is going to be the last. Sis. 
politicians and what and orders of of political appointment are what or political offices are what are generally assumed what to be conny and they are they are too decisive they are not man of their word they are not trustworthy they are not the man of word of integrity they are not honest or should be kind or should be straightforward or should be generous or even and they are very sly conny is the person that deceives a lot i get you the person that is not what no not 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 the man of word of his words that lies a lot So the opposite of it can be me. What is straightforward person? The opposite of the opposite that lie. Remember the word that lack integrity can be what is straightforward person. The third of us, an honest person, a reality person. So option one, option B, is a person. So it's just over. We have come to the end of this segment. Thank you for listening. Thank you for your attention. Thank you for your cooperation. I wish you nothing but success. All to you for the nomination. Goodbye and good luck. See you in the next class.